Hello, good morning friends. Today we will interface LED with 8051 microcontroller. First of all, start Proteus ISI Professional. Go to the PIC device and write 8089C51. Select microcontroller from the results and press OK. And place microcontroller over on your seat. Now we will take LED from libraries. For the type LED and keywords and select LED with library name active. It is most important to see your device. Now here uh, LED is on downside. I want it uh, place over here. Right click on LED and rotate anti clockwise. No, uh, it's a 180 degree rotate. I want to connect LED with its cathode terminal to its port pin. Now select, uh, now right click on your seat. Here you get terminals in places. Select the power terminal. To protect LED, I want another a register over here. So type res generic register symbol select and ok place over here you can zoom in zoom out uh, through your mouse scroll button connect your register with power terminal and register to LED and LED to your port pin Okay, so here is our Proteus circuit diagram. Now, now uh, we will write program in embedded C with Kale Microvision 4. Its ID, you can see it on over here. It's targeting for 8051 ARM and other many microcontrollers. Now select project new microvision project okay here we go uh, i am building a new folder go to the that folder and type your project name I am writing over here uh, led.c don't forget to write name with .c it will help you to make C file with your project name ok here we have to con uh, select the microcontroller so first I am selecting atmel uh, go to 89c fiber ok here uh, Kale will ask you to add a supporting file startup.a51. Click on no. Now uh, open target one in your project source group one. Double click on it. Select your project file led.c add and close. Now right click on target one go to options for target one here you have to define your crystal frequency 11.0592 okay it's in megahertz and go to put tab or here you have to select create hex file it will generate a hex file after compiling and click on ok 
now open source group one and double click on led.c now editor window will be open here you can write your <coughs> embedded C program first uh, right click on your C uh, seed and insert has defined include regx51.h this is your uh, library header file for 8051 microcontroller now to define LED I am writing s bit LED equals to or Here LED is connected with your port 0 point 0 pin. So now I am writing over here a port 0 correct 0, correct, zero semicolon. Don't forget uh, to write a semicolon after each line and uh, now void main here this is a begin curly bracket and this is a ending curly bracket here we will write our <coughs> main program First of all, I will write a delay routine. Here I need a two variables. Here I am defining a for loop i equals to 0 i less than equals to i i plus plus inside a for loop I am taking another loop J equals to 0 J less than equals to 120 and J plus plus here I am taking it as an integer and after J plus plus I want a semicolon over there in embedded C you have to define whatever function you write its prototype on top of your main program so copy and paste your uh, function prototype declaration after that I am defining port 0 as an output port so port 0 equals to 0 x ff so it will be declared as an output port now I am writing while loop Here I want LED to turn on and off on regular interval. So type LED equals to 0 delay uh, 
I'm putting 500 millisecond delay over here and LED equals to 1 and same as 500 second microsecond delay uh, okay millisecond yeah so here is our program is completed so click on save all and compile after compiling you will get zero errors and zero warnings so your program has been completed and writeed without errors you can debug it by, uh, by debug window start and stop debugging window okay yeah I want some peripherals so click on peripherals IO ports port 0 and uh, you can run from here or press F5 so you will see over here uh, port 0 LED 1 is glowing faster mm, I am stopping over here and go to the Proteus window and right click on your controller and edit properties here you have to select your uh, hex file so I am selecting my hex file run program from the play button mm. your LED is not glowing mm. because we are connected a register register must be a greater than 220 ohm so I am specifying over here at 220 okay and now play so you can see that LED is glowing on regular 500 millisecond interval. Mm. Thank you and have a nice day.